Cover, first of all, good to see you. How did you react to the news that broke about Roman selling the club? Good to see you uh, as well. Yeah, obviously it was big news and uh, it's still quite new, so we, we don't know what, what to say actually, but obviously the owner, uh, I, I came here at his time, so very thankful for everything he gave to, to this club and the club won so many trophies under him and grows, grows so much in the world. So Chelsea is now a, a huge, huge club, also thanks to him. So only a big thanks and uh, now we will see what, what's going to happen, uh, what will happen. Very well said. Talking about you, I mean, you seem to be really enjoying your football again. How are things with you? Yeah, very good, very good. We, I, I had a small injury, well, not a small, uh, a little bit the larger one. And now I feel good again. After injury is always uh, tough to the first weeks to, to come back, but now I feel very confident and uh, just happy that I can play again. It's one of the strange injuries, wasn't it? Wasn't it right at the end of a training session that it happened? Yeah, I had uh, two injuries here in Chelsea and two times it was quite strange. It was a back heel pass and two times, so two times the same injury. So I think I will, I will not do the back heel passes <laughs> anymore and be more careful about that. Obviously, there's never a good time to get injured, but what are you like as a spectator when you're having to sort of sit on the sidelines? Nervous, nervous. I, really? I hate it. Yeah, I hate to. I like to watch games, but I hate when I cannot help my team and when I, you see something that we can do better. So it's, it's difficult to watch it, but always I try to be the support to, to my teammates and obviously working a lot to, to come back as, as soon as possible. That supporter side of things is an interesting one because we were talking not too long ago about Kepa, funnily enough, and we were saying that during lockdown that there was a real sort of unity amongst you guys, even the players that weren't playing, so vocal, so supportive. That's key to this group, isn't it? That's key, and that was the key to our success uh, last year and this year as well because uh, it's not about 10, 11 players that are playing. It's, it's a club that it's about 20 players and the staff around it and the people that work in uh, this great club so it's it's about everybody and that's why we we're so successful the last the last year and uh, if we will keep uh, together like this i think it we will have many trophies at the end of the season of course i wanted to focus on you and your role because do you feel that your role in midfield has, has changed or evolved at all this year i think it changed uh, already with, uh, with uh, when the new manager came obviously the, the system suits me very well and uh, the style of play suits me very well so I think when, when he came, I started uh, to be confident and playing quite good. Then I had some, some injuries, which, which always is a little setback. But yeah, I, I feel good. And this year, I think I'm, I'm even more better going forward and trying to be more involved in create, creating chances and being, being uh, dangerous in the opposite area. So I'm glad you said that, because that's what I was going to ask you, because we are seeing more and more assists. And your, your passing accuracy is, has been phenomenal this year. Maybe the assist is also thanks to the strikers because sometimes when, 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 you, when you give the ball, they, they don't <laughs> score. And this year I had the luck that every pass that arrived, they, they score it. So I was happy when the stats are, are good, but I never watch the, the stats because I think it's, it's important, but not too important. Uh, my role in the, in the team is something else. And I try to, to be involved in, in, in other things on the pitch. So, so that's more my job, not, not the stats. You are far too modest. You've got to big yourself up more. <laughs> there was that part. <laughs> now, I wanted to ask about a couple of particular passes. The one for Lukaku against Villa, that thread ball was, was a special one, wasn't it? Yeah, it, it was a good one. And his run was obviously as well uh, amazing. And the pass was, was very good in the end, but his skill in the end was, was good. So it needs to be a full package that the striker needs to score, I need to give a good pass and then in the end it's, it's, it's a good goal. There is a good link up between the two of you, we saw it against Palace didn't we? I think it was your first touch coming off the bench was that through ball for him and unfortunately the goal from Hakim was, was offside but you seem to have a really good understanding. Yeah, yeah, from the first day I think we understand each other quite good because he, he holds up the, the game good, you can play uh, one and two with him good so he's an uh, he's, uh, amazing striker and we are happy. Lucky to have him in our squad. And so many options as well, whether it's Kai or, or Romelu, it feels that the, the, the shape of this squad gives you so much choice, so many options. It's important, yeah, because during a whole year you have uh, also some injuries, some players out of form sometimes, so you need everybody and that's why this squad is, is amazing because uh, one day another player can play, the second day there is another striker that comes in and does good. So this is also a strength of our squad to have uh, many players and that we, that we can rotate a lot. You mentioned the manager a few moments ago. It was interesting talking to him a, a little while back and he said, Kova's amazing, I can call him at three in the morning and he'll be ready to go. Um, what is it like to have a boss 
who has that belief in you as a player? Oh, it's amazing. It's it's obviously something that that helps you a lot because when the when the boss believes in you, then you you are confident and you can you can show your best. And in this case, it's it's a good connection. I feel I feel the, that he believes in me, and I just need to work hard and and do everything on the pitch that that we are successful. It's not been a bad year so far, has it? A couple of trophies, but I have to ask about the, the Carabao Cup final. Was that the most insane nil-nil you've ever been a part of? <laughs> yeah, no, it's it's just with the English Cups, it's it's not going in the in the last years, and we are we are losing some finals in in at Wembley, in which we we easily could 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 win it. It's, it can go the other way around, but this time we were not uh, lucky in the penalties, even though we had a, we had a great game. I think we did. Uh, we showed a big character in the 120 minutes, and we had a, a big, big game, which the manager also set. But yeah, in the end, uh, we lost, and we need to keep our our heads up and try to win another trophy this season. I think that that speaks volumes about the winning mentality in this group that you can perform like that on that stage, and you're like, no, 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 we want more, we want more. So there always seems to be there is that extra added incentive for you. We want more because we saw last season that. Uh, from a tough, a tough moment where we have we have been in, and to win the Champions League is is incredible. And we saw that uh, we can we can win a lot of trophies going forward because this is a, a good mixture between uh, experienced players and, and amazing young players. So this this group of team can be together for a long time, and we saw that we can win a lot of trophies, and it, this is what we want to do for this club. There is a good blend and we're getting players back from injury as well, a, a, a very crucial part of this season. What's achievable, do you think, in the last couple of months of this season? Let's see, we should go game by game. We are now in the quarterfinals of the FA Cup. We are still in a good position in the, in the Premier League. Obviously, in the Champions League, we, are, we, have, a, we have a good, a good first game. So, we are in three competitions still. and We will try to fight for, for every competition and in the end, let's see what will happen.